just want to get to it right away, but please don't forget to subscribe. Okay, please, can you subscribe? Just for me. <laughs> okay, just subscribe, hit the like button, like all those other YouTubers say all the time, like 24 out of seven. <laughs> but anyway, so guess what? Our strawberry plants have strawberries. Look, that's like strawberry here, strawberry here. And we have lots of them, and look, these are like the two biggest ones. There's another one underneath it, see? Here. It's kind of hard to see, I don't want to knock it off, but it's there. There's another one here, and another one over here. It's a big one, look at that. It's gonna be a big one like this, I bet. And this one's growing here. So here are what the flowers look like, like this one. This one has ants in it, though. This one has ants in it. You just take a look inside. Wait, eh. See that ants? Ah! They're going crazy. They're kind of saying, ah, who's shaking this? So here are all my strawberries. We have a lot of them. They're all blooming left and right. So, hmm, let's see, I want to take a look at. this constantly so one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve thirteen and then fourteen fifteen sixteen seventeen eighteen wow nineteen strawberries and there's still more flowers and there's still more buds so that means there's going to be at least what I'm going to say at least 30 strawberries I'm think I think it's going to be more than that because almost every single flower is having strawberries oh and there's another one here so that's going to be I think that's going to be a uh, 28 so <laughs> we have lots and lots of strawberries okay so we planted these last years from a one giant big strawberry and we just took out seeds, maybe a couple more strawberries, and we planted them and they did not grow. And then they came up and then they stayed this big for like the whole winter. And then we planted them here. So here are some tips for getting strawberry seeds. You don't need to buy them separately. If you already have strawberries in your home and you eat them on a daily basis, you can just take the seeds out from a strawberry. But the thing is you want to make sure you don't take any green seeds because those are not really ready to sprout. They haven't fully developed yet. So you might not want to take those green seeds. You want to get the colors that are like mostly reddish or brown. So you see, you don't want to take these green seeds. You want to take the little seeds that are here that are not that green color. Now it can be kind of a pain to take out the seeds one by one, but remember, one seed is one plant. So though this might be time consuming, it's way better than just going out and like looking for seeds on the market. So yeah, this is kind of hard to do. It's not the easiest way to extract seeds, but it works. Or you could just cut off the skin and then plant the seeds just like that. There you got a little thin slice and then you can just plant that in the ground and you can see that all these seeds are here and you can just plant them in the soil and a lot of little plants will grow just like that. And that's the way I got my plants and that works pretty well for me so you can do that too. Last year they didn't we did not get any strawberries but this year here they are. <laughs> So we realized that like, even though we didn't have that many strawberry plants, we only had a couple, maybe let's say 30, but I, I, I would say 
This is a whole lot more than 30, I'll say that. Cause you know why? So like these strawberries are like all round. They're kind of weird, you know, cause they kind of creep along the forest floor. So they release little tiny plant, little buds. You see here, it's happening right here. These little vines like just stick out. Here, they stick out and they have little leaves. This one's not growing well, but here's another one. You see, and they grow leaves on the ends and then they grow roots on their bottoms. And those ones, like literally like just grow leaves and like have buds too. And if you cut the vine, it'll still survive and it'll be a whole new other plant. So these guys spread like crazy. And actually they were starting to kind of go out of outside. Like they would go here and start growing right here on a lawn. So, you know, I would call, if they did not give us fruit, I think these would be considered weeds if they did not give us fruit. Cause they take over like crazy. But yeah, these are, you know, these are edible plants. So we plant them. multiple plants by planting either the leaves or just letting its vines crawl everywhere and take over the world. <laughs> but at least you'll get lots of strawberries. Like I am. I bet Opus will love these. <laughs> we love strawberries in this house because we like yesterday we had like this big bowl of strawberries. Two big packets of strawberries and they are disappearing. Never mind my mom just told me that they're all gone. So we finished two whole packets in two days. So it's like we bought these from Costco and they were just these giant packets of strawberries are gone in two days flat. And the thing is, is that me and my brothers just love, I guess it's because we love strawberries, but yeah. This is going to be good because we need lots of strawberries. I want to eat this one. And I want to eat that other one. <laughs> Oh, I can't wait until these ripen. It's gonna take forever, I feel like, but hey, it'll happen. These are growing pretty fast too. You can see already the seeds are coming up here. I think these strawberries are gonna be pretty big because the strawberry we took the seeds from was a pretty giant strawberry. I think it was like this big or something, so really big. Okay guys, so I promise I'll show you guys the strawberries once they're ripe and I'll show you the harvesting and I'll also show you, like, maybe I'll do a video of myself eating them. Nah, that'd be too cruel, don't worry. Unless, maybe I'll make it extra gross for you. Ha! <laughs> I'll be like, oh, no. Now I don't know what I'm talking about anymore, but anyways. So, bye! Thank you for watching and being with us today as we took a look at our strawberries. So, bye! Don't forget to subscribe, pretty please, so that I can keep on growing more strawberries, please. Thank you! Bye! Thank you for watching. If you want to see more videos, don't forget to subscribe. Bye!